Hey, Malachi, thanks for jumping on and sharing your fitness journey with us. Uh, to kick things off, can you tell us a bit about you? Uh, so I'm Malachi. Um, I just moved up here, start of the year. Um, kind of dabbled a little bit with the gym, you know, was in and out of it. Um, and now I'm kind of trying to like reach my goals. I've worked them out. I've, I've got a plan uh, and I'm trying to get there as quick as I can. That's awesome. Cool, cool. And uh, t tell us a bit about your lifestyle. So where, where do you, uh, what do you do and um, what are you aiming for as well? So I currently work at Woolworths, uh, nothing too, too special, but she pays the bills. Uh, my goal is to, I want to be a vet. Um, I want to, you know, work with animals. I've worked with animals all my life. I lived on a farm for the most part. So uh, I'd like to go on that kind of work. I think it'd be really fulfilling. Yes. Um, it's awesome. And we'll, we'll go from there, I suppose, you know. Yeah. I've, oh, we've all done odd jobs, you know, here and there. And it's great that you, you have a career path as well and you're going for that. And uh, not forgetting your, your health and fitness and your shape, right. shape goals as well, <laughs> which is awesome. Um, can you tell me why, why did you start training uh, with me? And, you know, what, what are some of the challenges or problems that you had? So I struggled a bit. My, nutrition was uh, a fair amount of it. I used to eat really poorly uh, or not enough. Um, and it just kind of confused me a bit. Um, and with working out, um, I watched plenty of videos, plenty of you know, like YouTube stuff, um, you know, as everyone does, I suppose. Uh, and you, you see what other people do. It doesn't necessarily work for you, though. It didn't really work all that well for me because it was kind of what they did. It worked for them. Like, everyone's different. Um, so I figured, you know, like I, I talked to you for a while. I met you at, um, at the gym. Um, we got to know each other a little bit. And I decided that to have that knowledge with me, um, your knowledge uh, to help me along to reach my goals um, would, you know, it's pretty crucial. <laughs> That's awesome. It's great that you you had that realization and early as well. You know, um, yeah, there's a lot of stuff online. There's, there's many different approaches, ideas, but, uh, you know, relevant knowledge that's that's personalized to you and you know having that support and you know those questions and you know those ideas and also to you know like like when we started we we spoke about your goals and what you accomplish and why uh can you tell us a bit about that like what what is it that you you wanted to go for uh there were little things like um in the workplace uh i struggled a bit there you know to do kind of hands-on work and whatnot um which yeah, like to be honest I, I feel like most men kind of want to have that ability to do that you know you want to be strong um so that was you know one of the little goals a uh, bigger goal um i you know, like i want to get better at uh, my little hobbies like archery and all that kind of stuff that involve a fair amount of strength uh which i didn't have um uh, cosplay is another good example as well. Um, I want to look. I want to look good. I want to be able to play these, you know, the characters. I see they got, you know, abs, huge muscles, you know. Um, awesome. And you know, uh, I wanted to be able to lift my my partner as well. Um, some little wholesome goals, you know. Yeah. <laughs> that's that's amazing. That's awesome. Yeah, and it's great that you have that creativity. And uh, I noticed that about you. You had. You know, you, you're able to picture what you want and and you had very clear, clear goals that you really wanted to aim for, which is awesome. And we got more specific and dialed in some numbers as well and some dates, which is always good. Um, yeah. did, did you have any doubts or concerns, you know, uh, when, when you first came across, you know, coaching or, you know, ha having a coach or trainer? Have you had a coach or trainer before? That's, that's what uh, No, I have, I've not had one before. Uh, I've signed up to programs um that say they're like you know run by like a coach and all that kind of stuff and they're like personalized to you but it's not it's i don't it, it's a bit of baloney i think um so I, like coming in like i was I, I i was a little bit hesitant um not with doubt though just kind of like i never done it before so i was just kind of moved slowly into it uh and i got to know you a bit better uh know what you're about your goals you know like how you how you do things how everything's set up um, and then I was without a doubt, like I was able to make a decision that, yes, this is for me. Um, I want you to be my coach. Um, and it was just, just an easy choice. Yes. Thank you. I appreciate that. Yes. <laughs> yeah. It's, um, it's, it's quite a wild world out there and many different, different approaches, but, um, definitely I, I, I've always preferred a personalized approach and, uh, you know, someone who takes the time to understand us. Um, I've, I've had coaches myself over the years and, and mentors as well. And uh, they, they made a world of difference um, many years ago. And uh, just more getting more clarity and, you know, 
those times when we're stuck and we don't know what to do or we're unsure of something, you know, just having someone yeah. to bounce, bounce with questions and ideas. And, um, and mentors, you know, someone who's kind of been there, done that, they can paint the part. Well, that's, you know? that's it. It's like, because um, I, I didn't really know much um, before, but now uh, I'm learning myself, but I also have, you've gone through your journey, you've gone through all that stuff. Um, and so now I have all of this knowledge um you know to help me along yes. and i've got it you know i don't how, how many years have you been working out for and doing this stuff like a while hey <laughs> yeah. uh yeah. I, yeah about 21 years ago i started this training uh mm-hmm. the first 10 years was a joke really <laughs> uh yeah. I've, made, I've made pretty much most of the mistakes i've worked with hundreds of guys and sat down and gone through all the challenges and everything they've they've been through and um experienced a lot but uh, like from my experience, my first 10 years was a joke because I, I, I did what I saw and like bigger chest and shoulders and arms and that kind of thing and became top heavy and then back issues, knees and neck and um, scheduling and overtraining and then rest and nutrition and all, all, these, all these problems that popped up that, that people have. It's like I can just relate and, and, and we can we know a solution forward from that. And um, yeah, it's the, the, the big shift and change happened for me around uh, 2014 when I met my mindset coach who helped me get clear on my vision and direction that I want to go in. And uh, the mentor, I had a world champ mentor, um, Ray. So the mindset coach was Chris and Ray. Um, just having coffee catch-ups uh, every week uh, or so with him and that just shifted my perspective of, of what's possible. And um mm. You know, him having traveled many, many, many years to get to the top, to become world champ, uh, you know, that's a lot of life experience and a lot of, uh, lot of challenges along the way. And just hearing his story and uh, all the possibilities, you know, that's, that, that, that made a big difference. And uh, also someone of that status uh, or that person who's, you know, accomplished that and believing in, in me, at, at that time when I was like unsure of myself or uh, that's, that, that really helps. I found um, yeah. so, someone to, to believe and support and, and drive, drive, drive you forward. Um, makes, makes a world of difference for sure. hundred percent, hundred percent. And and now that you've had all that and I've signed up, I've got all of that experience in literally the palm of my hand. Um, so, you know, my first, my first year of, of working out properly and, and starting to see real progress and all that kind of stuff. I, it's, it's going to be incredible already. It's only been a, a few months. Um, if that, you know, and I'm already seeing crazy gains, you know, um, <laughs> it's awesome. Yes. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. We've been checking out the gains and uh, you're, you're been ready for your, for the, for the cosplay and everything else. Like, can you tell us a bit about the actions you took and the kind of things you learned along the way? Yeah. Um, so I, prior to signing up to like the, the coaching and all that kind of stuff, um, I was a little bit all over the place. I wasn't very organized. Uh, I wanted to be, but I just didn't have like the motivation. Um, but so I decided once I, you know, um, signed up, um, listened to, you know, what uh, advice you had, got the plan going, all that kind of stuff. I was just going to put in as much effort as I can. Um, I, I, I think like we looked at the calendar the other week, whenever it was, and I feel like I've, I've hit most of, um, if not all of the, you know, um, and I, I got better at my sleep. I've set a schedule, uh, focused more on my diet and all that kind of stuff. I used to be really afraid about, um, a little bit stingy about spending money on food, um, you know, that kind of stuff, you know. Um, but now it's just like, if anything, if I'm going to spend money, it's on food because uh, diet is in huge. It's huge. Yes. Um, but I, I took a lot of um, a lot of steps and, and effort into really kind of honing those down and getting a lot of consistency, like right off the bat, which has, you know, clearly shown a bit of progress. Yeah. You know, it's yeah. <laughs> it awesome. Yeah, I was I was freaking surprised. Uh, you know, we caught up in person, and he showed up with a singlet like this, and I was like, "Whoa, this guy! It's only been four yeah, weeks, <laughs> and he's just crushed it, and he's brought That's in the guy." Yeah. It's awesome and and we shaping up the chest too you're looking really solid which is awesome yeah 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 i'm really um it's really feeling nice in the chest at the moment um which is good um my partner made a comment that she started to see it kind of fill out a little bit more um so that's always good you know we love that 
Um, but you know, like that's another thing as well. Like I've had a lot of people come up and, and uh, compliment me and, and just comment on it in general, uh, going like, I'm, you know, like whatever I'm doing, you know, working and all that kind of stuff. And mm-hmm. so little, little pats on the back here and there. It's, it's really nice stuff I didn't get before. Um, and now that I'm getting a lot of it, it's, it feels wonderful. <laughs> that's, that's amazing to you. That's really good. Uh, so, so how are you thinking and how are you feeling now that's, you know, you've, you've come this far and, you know, you've experienced, you know, what it's like to, to be in better shape, stronger. And like, like what's, what's your, what's your experience been? Oh, it, it feels, it feels amazing. Um, it's, 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 you can't compare it. Um, and I, I see how it's easy to sit for people to sit on a sideline uh, and, and without doing anything kind of be like, oh, you know, uh, maybe one day, but like one, now that I've gone there, uh, I'm, I'm better. I'm stronger. I've, you know, gone to the gym, getting pumps, you know, seeing myself after a good workout, my arms are just blown up, you know, <laughs> it's, it's an indescribable feeling. Um, and once you have it, there's no going back. Uh, I, I recommend anybody just come to the gym for like an hour and just see how they feel. And they'll, they'll see Oh, that's it. That's amazing. It's awesome. It's great to hear. And now that you've got your experience, like uh, how, where, where are you looking to go from here? Like what's, what's, uh, what, what do you, where do you see yourself in, fu- in future in a couple of months, maybe even a year? So short term, um, I definitely see, um, keen to see my chest come a little bit closer, like, you know, like in here, fill this bit out. Um, which would be really nice. Uh, I feel like my everything will start to grow a little bit more. Um, and long term, um, it'll be nice to actually kind of refine everything. Um, right now, I don't mind, like I'm enjoying bulking, um, getting that kind of experience and eating a lot and all well, that's fun, right? You can just, you know, like I understand my calories, my intake and whatnot, so I can have a bit of fun with it, play around. Yes. Um, which is which is good fun. I'm enjoying that a lot. Um, but I'm very keen to in in the in the future to uh, cut and experience all that kind of stuff and try and refine everything. Start seeing some abs and all that kind of stuff. You know, it's it's going to be a challenging kind of time. Um, but I'm looking forward to it. <laughs> it's awesome. Yes. Uh, yeah. It's it's a journey. There's there's many different phases that we go through, and uh, our goals shift and change as we do. But uh, it, it's great to have that vision, that long term goals, and uh, and yeah. Yeah, you've you've got that for sure, and that's awesome. And you're making great progress. You're motivated, crushing it, and uh, so, yeah, yeah. It's, it's been a great journey. It's um, yeah, and uh, loving the consistency and uh, and the progress. You know, just keep stacking those wins as you go, and you'll you know you'll just keep keep growing and keep making it happen. It's awesome. That's yeah, it. it's uh, like. I, like I have goals now, obviously, but when I reach those goals, just small goals, right? And they just appear out of nowhere. Like you're always going to see something. Uh, like uh, I learned um, taking photos is a huge thing, uh, tracking everything, uh, all that kind of stuff. Because then I can see. And then when I reach my goals, whether I want to be, I think our goal weight is 75 uh, at the moment. Um, once I reach there, uh, it's not like I don't think I'll, I, that I feel like maybe some people make the mistake of going, oh, I've reached my goal. That's it, you know. Um, but I'm going to see, you know, look through the photos, see things, and I'm going to be like, well, I want to fix that. Oh, I want to get this bigger. I want to get that bigger, you know, that kind of stuff. It's it's, um, it's a bit like you you climb a mountain, you know, and you climb a mountain to get to the top and achieve that goal. And once you're on top of the mountain, you actually have a, have a wider view, a broader view, and you, can, and you can see more, and you might see an even bigger mountain that you want to climb. So, exactly. yeah, so goals are great. Goals are like a destination. But, uh, you know, once you get to the destination, you, you've leveled up, you have higher standards, you have um, better performance, better everything, and, you know, better quality of life. And uh, from that point, you know, you, it's natural to want to grow and to, to want to achieve more. And uh, it's, it's great that you're thinking, thinking ahead as well, you know, and, um, and you have that vision, those inspirations, and everything else. And, and we'll go through even more mindset stuff as we go. And uh, yeah. yeah, ensure that everything is aligned and to to what it is you want want to achieve. You know, not just for now and but for the long term, and uh, make sure it's fulfilling. You know. Yeah, that's it. That's it. I'm really looking forward to it. Yeah. <laughs> anyway, it's been great. Thank you for jumping on and sharing sharing your fitness journey so far. You know, uh, and yeah, I'm looking forward to to seeing you keep going and keep growing. It's awesome. Uh, yeah. It's, it's been amazing. Thanks. And let's keep going. Yeah. Amen. Yeah,